we have got enough milks now. <laughs> Would everyone stop milking shit? <laughs> I went to buy a coffee recently. I have very straightforward coffee tastes. It should have been a very straightforward transaction. It was anything but. I went in there, I was like, hello, I'd like a white coffee, please. Okay, sir, what kind of milk would you like with your coffee? We've got a coconut milk, we've got an almond nut milk, we've got a hazelnut milk, we've got a cashew nut milk, we've got a macadamia nut milk, we've got an oat milk, rice milk, hemp milk, soy milk, you can have it from a bean, from a pulse, from a nut, from a grain, from an oat, from a flax, from a leaf, from a seed, from a tree. <laughs> I'd like it from a nipple, please. <laughs> I don't care what type of nipple, preferably a cow's, but I'm not fussy. I'll take it from whatever nipple I can get. She looked at me like I had requested it from hers. <laughs> like I was the weirdo. I'm not the weirdo. You're the one that's in the back of the shop with your little friends milking fucking cashew nuts. You're the freaks, not me. I do not for one moment doubt that lactose intolerance is a very grave and pressing issue for humanity. But lest I remind you, we currently don't have a cure for cancer and there are 12 readily available milk substitutes on the market, which I would argue is 11 more than we need. 